my uh, opponents uh, state that well, um, that we're going to use um, clones from reproductive clones, like raising a child up and then using it, then using their bone marrow or like something like their parts from an actual person to help someone someone that needs those parts. But with um, we can actually just make the part themselves. You don't need to make the person. The, you don't need the whole, make the whole person. Um, and while cloning um, is right now might not be um, the right, there's room for improvement, which is uh, there's a, needs a lot to be a lot more research done, which is one of the reasons why it should be legalized to help have more re have more research. And then um, about the the pig organs. Um, while they are indeed organs that are in a pig, they've been genetically modified to be actually human organs. They just happen to be inside and raised in pigs. Um, and then also um, with embryos, um, the embryos we're using to make um, organs and things, they aren't fertilized. And then so they are considered living for them, which means using them for these purposes wouldn't be considered killing. But, um, then also on the subject of, for cloning for and fertile couples, um, uh, basically, Infertile couples are obviously people, or couples that can't obviously have children by themselves. Um, it doesn't always have to be like a man and a woman. It could be a same-sex couples, or even um, single parents who may have lost their loved ones or something, and then they want to still raise a family of their own. And then um, using these cloning, they can be able to have possibly a clone, which would be like a twin of maybe a lost daughter or son. And um, that would help um, all infertile couples. Um, also, when certain stem cells are being rejected from the body, um, <coughs> it's normally because of issues with that stem cell. Um, there have been ways that clone stem cells from the actual person being used on in that person. What I'm trying to say is uh, if you take the stem cells from the person and then you use that to make their organ, it'll be better than using like someone else's stem cells. It'll be more precise or accurate. It'll have better results. Um,